What's up everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to import reviews from CJ Dropshipping to your Shopify store. So let's get right to it. First of all, you need to have your Shopify store up and running. As you can see here, this is my store. I've set up a, a test uh, Shopify store to show you how to do this. And you need to have an, a CJ Dropshipping account. So here I've gone to cjdropshipping.com and I'm signed in to my account right here, as you can see. So you need to be signed in and have CJ Dropshipping opened in another tab. So I'll show you quickly how to connect CJ Dropshipping and import products to your Shopify store, as well as how to import the reviews for this product from CJ Dropshipping. So first of all, you need to go to apps right here. And there are two apps that you need to install. The first one obviously is CJ Dropshipping and the second one is called judge.me and I'll show you why in a bit. First of all, let's install CJ Dropshipping. So type in CJ Dropshipping. Okay, it'll open up like the app store in a new tab. And here is the CJ Dropshipping app. So click on it. And then make sure the, this is the official app by developer CJ Dropshipping, then click on install. Then click on install again here. And then just click on authorize to connect your uh, Shopify store to your CJ Dropshipping account. Okay, click on uh, authorize here. Okay, let's, sorry, uh, check the please read and agree to the authorization agreement. Then click on authorize. And make sure this is the email that you signed in uh, with to CJ Dropshipping. And then it'll open up the CJ Dropshipping page and tell you that the authorization is successful and your Shopify store is now successfully linked to CJ Dropshipping. Now let's search for a product to uh, import. So go here to CJ Dropshipping. So let's close this tab for now. And here you can browse the products by categories or for the sake of this video, I'll just select like a random product. Let's say I like this heart-shaped pendant. Click on it, it'll open up any new tab. And here, as you can see, the product page is opened where it shows you the price and the title, all the details like the shipping, the return policy, shipping policy, and so on. And here you can view also the reviews as well. So here you can view the buyer reviews as well as the description. So here is the description of the item that you uh, want to sell. And if you click here on the buyer's reviews, you can see all the buyer reviews. And here it shows you even here that you can import these reviews to uh, Shopify store. And it, uh, it shows even shows you like a button to check a tutorial. So uh, once you are satisfied and decide to that you want to sell this product on your uh, Shopify store, click here to list the product to your store. And here choose the uh, store name make sure this is the uh, right store number so here because i have set up many stores before so i'll go back to shopify store go to settings and here under my store uh, let's check out or focus on the numbers and digits before dot my shopify.com and make sure they match the shopify the uh, cj dropshipping page so this is the right store Okay, uh, you can edit the shipping or choose a shipping like ship to country, shipping method and stuff like that. And here you can enter your price. So let's list it for like uh, 30. Okay, it converted the currency. So let's say 300 okay, of my currency to pound that'll equate to like $9.7. Okay, now uh, click on list it now. Okay, add a product type. Let's add a new here say pendant okay list it now we forgot to add a vendor so let's say test store for example okay now list the product now and let's go to the listed uh, page on our cj dropshipping and here as you can see these are the product that i added like earlier for different stores so the pendant is not listed yet so let's refresh the page Okay, and now as you can see, it is listed right here. So let to make sure it is listed, right? Let's go back to our Shopify store and go to products. And as you can see, the uh, like product is now added to our Shopify store. Now, 
let's go ahead to the second app that I showed you that we need to install. So go to apps. You need to go to uh, install the judge.me. It's already installed right here. However, I'll show you how to get it. So in the search bar here, type in judge me, enter. It'll open up the Shopify app store. And here is the judge.me product reviews. Just click on it and install it, then uh, go through the setup process. It's pretty straightforward to set up the app on your Shopify store. And now, once you set it up, I already have it set up as I told you. Go to apps here, choose the judge.me reviews. It'll open up the app settings page. From here, you want to go to manage reviews. Okay, this is like a sample review that I added for uh, a product that I set up, a test product. You want to click here on import and export and here you want to select view all other apps because cj dropshipping is not shown by default on this list so go to the very bottom where it says others import wizard and here you can import a csv.xls and xlsx uh, files so to get this file you need to go to cj dropshipping again go back and click to open the product page from the list right here this will take us back to the product page go down and click here on buyer reviews okay and now export reviews the reviews it will be downloaded as a .csv file make sure it's downloaded to your computer now go back to the judge, uh, sorry, to the Shopify uh, page where you have the judge.me manage reviews and click simply on add files and then go and select the file that you already downloaded, the .csv file, click open and here it shows the file, click on import and here the uh, file is now imported. So you can edit, so like edit the title uh, review fields uh, like here call name the title matches the title column in the CSV uh, file as well make sure all the uh, like names are uh, matched and here the rating and the review body and the title are the most important ones then click on the import and before you do just a quick note make sure that the name of the product on your Shopify store matches the name on CG dropping so make sure you do not change the name of the item uh, or the product once you import it then click on import okay uh, confirm import okay setting date okay let's go to the date setting reviews date okay let's let's say created at okay now import import again okay now it's uh, import it says import in progress so if we go and check out the online store click here on the i next to online store to view it okay it'll open any new tab where it shows your store and here is the product that is added if you scroll down you you shouldn't be able to see the reviews because we need to add like the uh, judge.me section to the product page so let's go back to the shopify store and then click on online store themes it's selected by default and now click on customize right here and in the pages uh, select products and then default product it gets you to the product page and in here you want to go ahead to the template you want to click on add block and here you should see app uh, blocks just scroll down till you see the reviews uh, review widget by judge.me reviews click on it and it should show up right here and as you can see here the you have some sample reviews just click on save and to make sure the reviews are added just simply exit first of all uh, save if you haven't saved the same changes i already saved them just exit the editor and then go to the uh, go back to the apps on judge me judge.me reviews and manage reviews and now if you scroll down you should see all the reviews that are imported from cj dropshipping right here so that's how easy it is to import product reviews from cj dropshipping right into your shopify store